all right and welcome to another destiny 2 stream uh today we are gonna dive right back into the la the final shape um the lc and uh see where that takes us i think probably wouldn't hurt to hop out to the tower grab some bounties and stuff then it's like ada's got something for us too and last time it worked much better when i went to the tower first um so anyway i know that i originally had marked this as canceled uh for tonight but uh something came up and plans got shifted again so uh here we are uh and we're doing destiny 2 because i didn't have a whole lot of time to set it up i mean i still have about like 20 minutes i guess i could have gotten my normally scheduled stream set up by the time 9 30 rolled around but you know this was already set up new game kind of want to approach it or dive a little deeper into it to see how I really feel about it. Um, and uh, not just have it be the Red Death fan stream. Leaving the Final Shape campaign. Return to the Pale Heart. Attention, the Final Shape campaign is structured as a full end end narrative. For best experience, we recommend completing the campaign missions before playing other activities. Okay. That's a first. I don't think I've ever gotten a message like that in any other previous DLC. They usually want you to, you know, yes. play other things. It's good to see you again, Guardian. Ada One greets you. Recent events have stirred up and up, up and pleasant family memories from the Golden Age, and I'm glad to be working with someone I can trust. Lord Shax and I are determined to get you ready to face the witness. She continues, I can recreate a famous, or maybe infamous, weapon from your past, but I'll need your help. Several years ago, you foiled a heist in the old tower. I've created a simulation of the event, events using modified Vex tech from the infinite forest, she explains. I can extrapolate data from your run through the simulation and use it to refashion the weapon, perhaps even improve upon it. Anything to save us from the collapse, she concludes. I can't lose another family that way. Outbreak perfected, huh? Didn't that... Hmm. Did we already get that game? Was that... Oh, wait, that was a Lone Wolves thing, wasn't it? It's an old DOC, D1. So, hmm. Okay. Calm down. I said calm down. You'll get your pop a different day. It takes coins. Or glimmer. Probably glimmer. I wonder what the slot looks like for Glimmer. Unless you know, it's like now where Glimmer is just kind of stashed away and everything's digital. All right, bounties. And there was, I'm probably not going to run. Hmm. So kind of useless. I doubt I'll actually end up uh, firing any one of these weapons. Take it easy. Uh, you never know. 
All right. Open director. Quests. Yes, I got the bounties. Destinations. Where is the exotic quest? Definitely not here. There's the helm. There's something there. Echoes Act 1, a familiar voice, war table. Sp whispers of the past. Speak with Eris Morn, Morn on the moon. That's got to be previous DLC stuff. Alright, let's go here. Get this this story bite or beat out of the way quick. Ah, I love how ridiculous that ship looks. Just a pyramid that glows. I don't have anything in here, do I? No. All right. Messages. Echoes Act One, a familiar voice. A hand handwritten note from Zavala lies on the war table addressed to you. Guardian, there are no greater words to call one to action than a threat. There's a blade at our throats, and the thing that holds it believes we are already beaten. We've been under underestimated before. We will be underestimated again. Their desperation will never outshine our hope, our resolve. Stand with me, Guardian. Stand with me, all Guardians. And together, let us show one more God the error of their ways. I'll look for you on the other side. The Vanguard is with you. Eyes up, Guardian. Vanguard, Commander, Zavala. Episode Echoes will begin the week after the conclusion of the final shape. During this time, you can process your Echoes and Grams at the war table. Okay. Weapon and reprisal weapon. The echo weapon takes two echo engrams to create. Okay. What is it? A sword. Ill omen. Seems pretty good. Honestly, do not know what I just dismantled. <laughs> or if it was a good idea. Alright, so that, that was all I wanted me to do here. Okay, yeah, now it just wants me to play through the campaign. Now, let's see what Eris wants. We gotta waste some time at the beginning, right? Otherwise, I might complete two missions. That's ridiculous. Though I did start a little bit earlier, so we could probably go a little bit longer yet, too. Yes, I drank from the moon. It's my shirt. 
blending in too? I can't tell. It shouldn't. It's not green. It's gray. Is there a reason we should speak? I don't know. Welcome, my friend. Eris Morn turns to face you. The Akamara bone in her palm grows fa glowing faintly. Even through the, her blindfold, Eris's gaze is piercing. Guardian, she begins. It's my understanding that you're sharp sharpening yourself against the forces of the witness, making ready for a final reckoning. By brief time, his hive god made it clear to me that some preparations can be made without. Others must be made within, she says. I have a proposal to do both, she says. If you are willing to delve into a troublesome memory, I can use your forgotten recollections to reassemble a great weapon from your past. And in facing the darkness, she concludes, you may find even more power than you imagined. So whisper of the worm. Complete exotic mission, the whisper. All right. Cool. There is war on the air, Guardian. Speak quickly. Probably won't be getting to that anytime soon. Destroy those that would worship the darkness. Unless Avlor wants to do it. But is it even in... Uh... I have a feeling they've already completed that one. The Lost City Pale Heart. Bet you Lapla. Refuge of Speakers. Oh shit. Anyone else forget about the speakers? <laughs> They're rather insignificant role. Unless you read all the lore cards. Then they're pretty significant. In a rather terrifying way, if I remember correctly. Let's get down to business. Oh, they have a combat difficulty thing now. That's kind of cool. Strange being back on this side of the comms, just like the good old days. Now, last transmission I got from Crow was just before you showed up. You said he and Glint were scouting ahead. Right. He called in some sort of anomaly, said he'd sniff around the perimeter. Personally, I prefer a little more direct approach. You always had. Keep wanting to explore. And I remember it's not really a whole lot of collectibles worth exploring for in Destiny 2, to my recollection. Hey, I ever tell you about the Hunter Vanguard before me? His name is Andal Brask. He was my mentor. Great shot. Terrible gambler. Still, we had this friendly little wager about what was inside the Traveler. I told him. There's nothing. So, of course, Andal says, well, then I'm betting on everything. <laughs> everything. Uh, lucky guess. The inside 
is a composite of the outside. You're gonna see some things you recognize and some things you don't. Treat it all as real, unless it ain't. But I can guarantee you the Shadow Legion up ahead are as real as they come. Shadow Legion ahead. All right. Bring it on. If you've got something to say, say it to Red Death. this weapon. <laughs> uh... Forget what it's called. Well, no. Well, spring. Yeah, well, spring. Life springs are not a fantasy. Such an angry little bird. Oh. <laughs> There's a prismatic flare here the entire time. I, uh, could have sped that up a little bit. Can 
Can I do anything with that? Uh, I'm guessing this is going to be something I deal with later. Cyanic insight required. All right. So far, very pretty. I mean, the graphics do look a decade old, but, um, You know. The bird from our vision. That can't be a coincidence. Let's follow it. Not too bad for a seven year old game, though, right? Kate, is that you? Glenn, where's the damn kid? I've been trying to raise you both on comms for hours. Gone. The hell do you mean, gone? The anomaly we were investigating, it's. A construct of darkness, I think. A, a cave mouth. It felt... wrong, like it doesn't belong here. I begged him not to go inside, but, but you know how he is. I tried to follow, I did. I did. That barrier, this place, the cave, it's... it's impossible for me to push past it all. Stay where you are. We'll find a way through. Did not reload. Always more Ikora's thing. Good thing Ikora is here somewhere. I think those taken silence might share a connection with that dial. Think, huh? Where's the other? There's gotta be more of them. There we go. supposed to like lure them here There. That's it. Do you see any 
got to defend it. Please hurry, Guardian. Crow has no one to raise him if he falls. Glint, this ain't your fault. He's my guardian. My responsibility. And you're his. I know you want eyes on him. But you need to stay out of sight until help gets there. Now, where are those signs? Now we want to rotate counterclockwise. So we have one more. And this is the first one I found. There's the last one. Looks like we just keep going clockwise. Be all tricksy about it. That will get us back to start. And just need one. Back to the next one. And then we need two. to glint well, it seems pretty obvious to me i think it's pretty obvious to you too the real mystery is why nobody wants to say it out loud i will a traveler it's helping us is it though
Oh boy. That's a problem. I forgot I was on a cliff. Sure, we'll place a banner. Apparently charges the light. That should not have worked, but it did. Way to run. Hey, knock them out. Got my grenade change changes in this form. Oh, come now. That's some bull. Try to get my back to this cliff side instead. Hey. Enough of that nonsense.
Got my concentrating face on. I'm coming with you. No, Clint, you all. The Guardian will give us the all clear. Sure, yeah. Give an all clear. Glimmer fell down. I mean, if it's free, might as well. Hmm. Grims. I like the Grims. They're fun. Seems like a waste to use on just one enemy. There we go. That's much better. Alright, and that's... Not all? Alright. We'll take you out. Superpower, or whatever the hell they call it again. More meters to manage. Oh, Christ. I wasn't that low on health. Very rude. Oh, shh. Get 
me out of there. Get a little health down. Let it go. about what happened the first time. Playing the prismatic wall. Ah yeah. Getting some of the good stuff back. this that grenade cold snap grenade mm. I kind of like the arc and we'll keep that there keep you what else did I get 1918. It's better. Make me stronger. Our ghost is possessed. That diorama. It is but a fact symbol. A testament to loyalty. An expression of glory. Crow. We see his heart held in talons. We hear it beat with his twin sister's skills. Within the final shape, we offer the vision of our pride. With yours, friends, looking for him with trust. But, like you, he chose pain. You use the darkness to exploit Crow's memories? And the light to give them form. Don't you see how beautiful it all could be? I don't know. Not the best sculptures.
Oh, look at all the faces. Cute. Am I supposed to do something with that? Ah, turn around and go up. Guessing he kept resisting, and so they just keep torturing him. Hey, the Iron Lords. Crap. seen these veiled statues before. You have too. It's whispering something, but I can't quite make it out. Stop listening to it! I told you to wait outside. This place is... I don't know what kind of effect it's going to have on you. He's right, Glint. I don't care. He doesn't get to make those decisions for me. We're supposed to be a team. Guardian and Ghost. That's how the Traveler made us. I'm sorry. Don't ever leave me behind again. Promise. I promise. Let's set up camp outside. Kate's not far. Of course he isn't. Tell me you got the drop on him at least. You and the Guardian both need bitter boots. Well, maybe I'll get lucky this time. We did it. We completed another mission. And with time to spare. secrets and I will become your most loyal servant <laughs> uh, I'm going to regret those words later I'm sure Excerpt from the Van Nett letter. 
It's hard to describe. It's like these pockets of darkness are physical manifestations of the witness's presence here. An infection festering. You said it spoke to you. In the dark. Tempting me. The witness knows what's in our hearts and minds. It promises to make it all real. Listen. Whatever the witness is doing to the traveler, our ghosts can feel it too. And it's spreading. Ikora would know what to do. Oh, don't worry, kid. We'll find her. Even if we have to blast our way through. I don't think it's that simple. Sometimes it can be. Let's just get our bearings again, refocus. Agreed. That's it? Story time's over? Vanguard mail. That is mine. That is mine. Season rank six. Please collect your items. In the season pass menu of your director. What a relief to see Crow and Glint again. That cave we found him in, where the witness tried to possess me. A malignant place like that inside the Traveler feels blasphemous. That wasn't just darkness. It was reshaped by the witness. Corrupted. No wonder it could project itself there. At least out here, the Traveler's light still protects us. As much as it can, anyway. My shell? Don't worry. It's not as bad as it looks. The witness barely left a crack. We take hits and we get back up again. Right, Guardian? Listen, the others spotted a location nearby that resembles the Io Cradle. Sounds like something that would be of interest to a warlock we know. The witness's presence inside the Traveler has manifested as psychic wounds, spreading physical corruption through its pale heart. These concentrations of darkness are dangerous. Ghost claims that the damage he took while fighting the witness's possession is superficial, but you recognize when he's lying. Both he and the Traveler are very hurt, and things are only going to get worse if you don't find a way to stop the witness. Vanguard warlock Ikora will know what to do. You must find her. Oh yeah. New sidearm. I really like the Sterling. It's a good one. Maybe I can. Let's put it into. Put it into Quicksilver. Not that that, you know, makes Quicksilver any better. Okay. Let's see. I already talked to you. I've got to... That's the helm signal. Mara, we can barely hear you. I'll try to boost the connection. Crow? Does this reach you? She can't hear us. I'll keep trying to clean up the signal. 
The portal remains unstable, and your enemy has barred the way behind you. The abominations you encountered are of the witnesses' making. This is but a fraction of the power it now wields. Using stolen light, it has created a new army in opposition to the one the Traveler raised. Stewards of the final shape. No matter. The Coalition convenes to devise a method of dispelling the Witnesses' interference. Keitel and Misrax have promising theories. Once this desperate attempt to slow us is left broken, we will rejoin the attack. Let my voice send you now, in flight, to strike down the Witness and all its followers. Go with hope, and with vengeance. That's a pretty cool looking sword. The final shape. Search for the wreckage of a chorus ship. Guys, I came across some wreckage when I was scouting earlier. Dismissed it as another anomaly until Ghost described Ikora's ship. No one was inside. So she's alive. We just have to find her. Yeah, and that's always easier said than done. I'm sending you some coordinates. You're on the lookout for something that resembles the cradle on Io. We'll start there. Memory is the key. Not the only ones looking for Ikora. Mm -hmm. The hive already bothering you? We can handle them. Well, go right ahead. I'll be here for more support. Concentrated darkness. The least we can do is put it to good use. Hello? Anybody home? More of the witnesses' abominations. Careful, Guardian. Oh, boy. You really like to just charge right in here, don't you? Too. Lovely. That's a good, good hand cannon. Coming up on the coordinates of that wreckage. Um, Any sign of Ikora? Freaking husks. Or her ghost? Nothing yet. Okay. So it's a trick. All right, that did not do what I wanted it to do. There we go. I'm guessing where the black smoke is. There. Up ahead. We know Ikora abandoned her ship. Maybe she found something. Maybe so, but going it alone isn't worth the risk. I learned that the hard way. Luckily, she's got the two sharpest hunters in the system to back her up. 
Oh, yeah. And when do they get here? <sighs> Taking a dig at himself. That shield and creates cut. concentrated light. You can use it to power those wells. When light rises, darkness recedes. Sounds like you've been reading Icora's field journal. I always try to learn from the best. Not that one. This one. No. My relic. They took it from me. More hive ahead. Eyes up. Zivu Arath's followers again. Of course they'd answer the witness's call. Well, I'm glad somebody's been paying attention. Me, I see three glowing green eyes. I open fire. And then apologize to Eris later. <laughs> Is that implying that he's, uh... Murdered Eris? Or, like, shot at Eris before? Just a little walk in the park, no big deal. Just need a key. Apparently. That's not the one I needed. Ah, yes. I forgot. I have two light abilities equipped. Probably switch that back. Alright, where is my crystal key? I need it to unlock my door. Yes. It's right in front of me. Okay. Let's quick adjust this. Finger snap, it's so good. So cool. Oh. 
gonna collect some demon souls. There we go. Perfectly done. Not the crystal key just yet. Is there another darkness? Do it with him. Do have to do it within a certain amount of time. Here. Not sure exactly what's going on. There we go. So yes, I see the light. There's, there's probably a particular order I have to put them in. All right. So, is this one one? Okay, that one's flowing. Got it, got it. Must have just got lucky that first time. This one was three. So it's one. Uh, I have to alternate between light and dark. That's gonna reset it. That's three. That one's four. This one's two. Okay. No, not what I wanna do. Ah, puzzles, puzzles, puzzles. That took me too long to figure out. Alright, so we need one. Which is over here. It's in a nice little circle, so it shouldn't be too hard. Go back and get my shield. Then go to three. Alright. And now to four.
really should have been paying attention. Using both light and dark energy is what brought down that barrier. Mara often spoke of the balance of light and dark. We awoken, were made in conflict. Our connection to darkness is as ingrained as our connection to light. Not all guardians are awoken, but it does feel like we all share that conflict. Chain lightning and threadling grenade. We look kind of like the threadling grenade. We'll switch that. I remember liking the threadling grenade, but I guess, yeah, I guess we'll see. Interested to see. Because right now it looks like we only get four, and I'm guessing those are going to be unlocked throughout this main campaign, which is, yeah, seems like we're unlocking them pretty early. This is definitely Ikora's ship. Let's take a closer look. So hopefully, eventually, we'll have access to all of our abilities. It's been a while since we've scanned anything with ghosts like this. Commander, Guardian, I hope you were both safe and that you found Crow. I haven't been able to raise you on calm, so I cannot be certain. You know I am not one to be moved without evidence. How did you put it, Zavala? Scientific obstinance. But there is an uncanny sanctity to this place. I feel an impulse. I seek to commune with the Traveler myself. I sense if I reach out, that it will reach back. If not here, where? Find me. I'll be at the Cradle. It's just how I remember it. That is an improbable rock formation. Stay sharp. I'm picking up a reading very similar to something Crow and I ran into shortly after we arrived. What, another charming gunslinger with roguish good looks? A high vulgar. But it definitely has your humility. Spare shield breaking projectile. Can't I go in there? Let me in. It's a secret tunnel. Let me in the secret tunnel. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, that's not good. Can I make it back up? I sure can. Faces, creepy faces. Um. Okay. 
Where, where am I taking this? I didn't see any portals. Or pools or founts, whatever they call themselves. Down here? That's the way I came. Oh, they're up here. Bloop. There's our older friend. Hi. Remember me? Why was it not shielding me like it did the first time? Darkness first. Come on. There's some ads. Yes, I know ghosts. I don't see it. Could use my super, but what's the point? We're already close to that third or that second bar being out, so my method was effective. Do I have to re-engage those? Nah. Finish this right here, huh? All right, I got gotcha. you. <laughs>
and it's over. It's down. And look, light. It's creating a path forward. Guardian, I'm sensing a surge in power in both light and dark. Hey, when we find Ikora, if she's... Ikora's strong. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, that's good. Great. Um, but not really what I'm worried about. I was gonna ask if you think she's still mad at me. For what? Well, I made a promise, then I broke it. I died. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, here's the surge of light. Why can't I do anything with it? Ah, that's just what was creating the path. I see. Disappointing. Ooh, purple. I see him. Okay, so their bellies are not here. Um, good spot to avoid getting shot by those annoying freaking things that burst out of their chests. Oh, you think you can get away from that? Alright, so I gotta go up here. I don't know why people complain about them. I mean, they, they, you can finish them off at uh, pretty high in their health bar. She's deep in meditation. 
If Ikora zend out, she might actually get some answers from the Traveler. Thank you, Guardian. I, was I thought that there, maybe okay. here, maybe the Traveler might give me some sort of guidance, as it once did for the Speaker. I close my eyes and I open my heart and mind. I think I heard it. Screaming. So did we, when we came through the portal. This place. We know. The witness infecting the Traveler. Darkness combined with light. I wish Osiris could see it. He was always ready with a hypothesis. But here's mine. The witness brought darkness into the Traveler. Everything you see here inside it is a physical manifestation of a thought made real by the light. Your thoughts, mine, the witnesses. It plans to weaponize that light, reshaping reality outside the Traveler into a perfect stillness. A great silence, never changing, never dying. Imagine your greatest triumph, or your most profound regret, immortalized as a part of a universe where nothing exists except by the witness's consent. It chooses what your eternity will be, and imprisons you safely inside it. This is its promised salvation. This is the final shape. The Witness sees itself as the god it wishes the Traveler was. And although the Traveler resists the Witness's corruption, it and everything we know will eventually succumb. I always warn Zavala not to put all his faith in the Traveler, to save some for the rest of us. Maybe faith in the Traveler is exactly what we need. If light is powerful enough to destroy the universe, then light is powerful enough to destroy the Witness. I guess we'll see. New objective. Join Ikora at the campsite. You got it, dude. Calm down. You might say now, Drifter. I was there. Why did... So, is there anyone else with you? Not Commander Zavala, I assume. This isn't quite up to his standards. Hey, I did my best, all right? Given the circumstances, I think Big Blue will forgive me. Will you? No. It's too much. It's just too much. It's one thing for the witness to look in our hearts and minds to conjure up our memories, but this... Ikora, hey, come on, look at me. I see you. I know this is hard. It's tough for me, too. 
tough. What do you know about tough? You are always running off to play renegade, leaving me and Zavala to shoulder all the responsibility when... when we were supposed to be a team. I know. I'm gonna make it up to you. Don't get ahead of yourself. <laughs> you still have a lot to make up. Well then, we better get started. <laughs> What's up, Avalar? What did what did Icor do that wowed you? Get upset? Icora has always had a strong connection to the traveler. I think that's why she's so confident. Why she's never needed the faith Zavala has. She hasn't sought guidance like this for a long time. But this place makes you reassess what faith means to you. Ikora said our memories reshape the landscape. Like the ascendant plane. But here it's pure. It's not a recreation, it's a reimagining. That's why the witness is here. It wants to weaponize the Traveler and transform the universe into a fixed state based on what it believes we deserve. The Witness thinks purpose is a static idea. Its promised salvation is a perfect ending it chooses for us. That sounds more like obsession to me. You can't bottle life. You can't pin its subtleties in place. It's wild. And very... Imperfect. Like the light, it shines out in all directions, shadows and all. Commander Zavala would agree. Come on, Guardian. We've got a fire team to reunite. Damn right we do. The evi or evidence points to the witnesses weaponizing the Traveler's light to reshape reality, just as the Traveler once terraformed planets and created ghosts to raise Guardians. What you've seen inside the Pale Heart is only, be only the beginning. It believes itself to be a god of both light and darkness, and what are you if not a god killer? The only members of your fire team unaccounted for are Commander Zavala and his ghost, Tarj. Is it Tarj? Locate them before the witness does. You got it. Listen to the radio at Refuge of Silver Wings. Is that where I'm at? Oh yeah, definitely preach. <laughs> I do like that Nathan Fillion is back for um, Cade, but feels feels like the family's back together. All right, radio. Scans are conclusive. Your body is a construct of light, even if you aren't able to wield it as a weapon. Well, I guess I need my ghost to do that. Yes, but still, this is nothing short of a miracle. A miracle that could only be made possible here, in this impossible place. You sound like Zavala. Next you'll be saying that the Traveler brought me back for a reason. It did. My Cora. Give me a better explanation then. I don't have one. All I got is my hand cannon. No golden gun. Ghost. Can I ask you something deeply personal? Shoot. What did you see when you died your final death? Well, that ain't fair. No, it isn't. Light. So bright it burned me all the way up, but I didn't feel any heat. Not a lick. I didn't feel anything, actually. Not with my body, because I left that back there. These anatonauts might call it being one with traveler but I call it home no pain no fear no vanguard paperwork that's him and Sundance oh, she was shining there too you want to know a secret I miss it even more than I 
miss you. That seemed like a very private conversation. <laughs> All right, let's see what time is it. I have 15 minutes. Probably not enough time to finish this next campaign. But you know, we unlocked, we found Crow, we found Ikora. Do we really need Zavala? Let's just go fight the witness. Come on. Let's go. Oh boy. Alright, did I rank up at all? No. Step 9 of 34. Avalar, you'll be happy to know that there are even more exotics to get. I don't know how related they are to this DLC. But... Kind of want to just explore shit. Oh lord. <laughs> what? How is this out of bounds? It's a wide open space. And I was over there before. Maybe it's just hmm, part of this instance. Weird. Um. Yeah, I guess that's something we could do. Dang it. Here, let's let's see. I've gotta have a new exotic list here somewhere. Journey, collections. Uh, there's lore, there's the exotics. There's a kinetic. Two unknown. So for sure two there. Oh, there's there's red death. Buried bloodline. I don't recognize that one. Is that symbol the same as on the red death? No. Okay. So that's from something else. All right, so there's Red Death. And there's two unknown ones. Well, I guess that's it. Oh, wait, there. Yeah. And then the armor stuff. Speaker's Sight. I can become the speaker. That's actually kind of cool looking. <laughs> or how basic it is. Oh boy, yeah. Maybe this one? Don't like the studs on that one. That, that's better. I don't know. Take some f figuring out. That kind of looks Iron Man. But, uh, I'd have to actually change my, oh, that looks pretty cool. Anyway, yeah, definitely a few more to explore. Just for you, you shiny hunter, you. Ah, uh, wait, I already made that mistake. Um... So I guess I should probably go wrap up this stream then. Oh boy. I feel like I got a sneeze. But, uh, I mean, there, there's, yeah, got a few things to talk about. Like, the rumor going around that there's going to be a Halo uh, Combat Evolved remake. 
and that it's also rumored that it's going to come to PS5. That's a good one. Let's see if anything is said on Sunday when Xbox does their announcement, but... Um, well, what else was there? A Ubisoft event next Tuesday. So, more information on all of their stuff. And then I think on... Then the... The... Not the Game Awards. The other one. The Showcase. Uh... S GF? SGF? Is something Game Awards? Or Game Announcement? I don't know. Uh... <laughs> Um, they, the, that whole shebang be on Wednesday. So be interesting to see what all is happening there too. Um, yeah. And, uh, probably we'll do a makeup stream for Final Fantasy VII Rebirth tomorrow. Um, but we'll kind of see if I can fit that in tomorrow night. Uh, uh, I'll I'll add it to my schedule. Who knows? Ebler, are we are we are we are we doing anything tomorrow? <laughs> Suppose you have you have off. We could probably after you're done after you're done gaming. But that'll depend on if Ada wants to stay up that late. No idea, but ye. <laughs> yeah, they're so uh, so unpredictable with. With with that, with them too. You never know when they're gonna be on. They're like, it's very inconsistent. Yogi seems to be on almost every night, except for like when well, I don't know, <laughs> except for like some random ones. And it's just like I don't know when you guys play just <laughs> maybe i should reschedule my my streams just figure it out try to figure out a pattern but uh yeah cuz that cuz ada was on like late last night and then he's not at all last i checked he wasn't on at all today so i don't know but uh yeah so i'll probably do a rebirth tomorrow unless unless uh uh, uh, they want to do something, which it is. It is Friday. We usually do something at least Friday or Saturdays. So I kind of keep my ear to the ground, I guess. Uh, but yeah, you have the day off. So maybe we could do something during the day too. So I don't know. Like, uh, do some lethal company or something. Or I could do chores around the house. That's always an option, too. <laughs> anyway. Um, I really... I wasn't always an option yet. Uh, also don't want to, like, take away from your chill weekend, too. But, uh, and also your game prep tomorrow. So, uh, yeah. So it'd probably have to be tomorrow night if we did anything. After you's done. Yeah, I feel like Ada's always doing something, or always down to game on Fridays, because he's always saying that we have to wait, or like, he's always waiting for you to join him after your game, so. Getting all salty. <laughs> that he has to only talk to me. Um, but yeah. What else was there? Uh, there's another war bond that's going to be dropping for hell divers next week too. I think the 15th, I want to say June 15th, there's going to be another one, which is crazy. I feel like they just did the, the like ice themed one, like the Hoth themed one, but I didn't, yeah, I didn't hear anything about what's going to be in this one. There are so many already, right? I haven't even been able to collect enough super credits to buy any of the other ones. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could pay for it, but like, the f don't have the fucking budget to do that. 
And that's not the kind of gamer I am. I like if you offer me free currency, <laughs> I'm going to avoid spending real money. Hell, I do that even when they don't offer it. I'm just like, well, guess I'm just not getting that skin. Um, only time I guess I do that is for like with free to play games. But uh, yeah. Um, and then I guess today's stream definitely starting to feel like this DLC is actually turning out to be pretty dang good not still not hitting that like feel that feeling of uh that uh forsaken kind of gave you gave me which that was like a phenomenal dlc um which i think they might have been trying to go for here especially with this icor arcade um conversation that they're having but maybe that will go continue on especially once we see Savala again I mean it's a it's the, the end of the story kind of like the, there's going to be a lot of bleak conversations but I don't know uh, not seeing a lot of the things that people were complaining about on uh, Steam reviews and stuff like that like like the voice like they're saying like the voice acting wasn't very good but I think the voice acting is just fine like I none of it's really changed <laughs> the writing's still about the same like the only thing is like maybe Cade's not throwing out as many one or like one liners as he like did in earlier games that he was in but um I mean some people were complaining about Zavala's new voice actor uh I think it's David Keith or Keith David I don't remember um, but I, I don't know, his, his one line that he delivered I thought was fine. But I guess we'll find out in this next mission when we hear him a little bit more. Um, but yeah, I don't, I don't think it's, I think it's fine. It feels like Destiny 2. Um, the new, the new, um, oh, what is it, subclass, like, supers and stuff like that. It's kind of meh so far but I mean it's also early in the, the campaign so you haven't unlocked much of anything yet um, I have a few more options but it's not so far it's not as uh, in depth of like build your own as like I would hope but I mean there's lots of I'm, I'm sure we're, based off of the amount of like slots and stuff that pop up is we're gonna we're gonna be unlocking some shit so um, and they're going to be adding some stuff. They're probably just going to slow release it, which whatever, man, it'll be fine. <laughs> um, but yeah, I kind of, I don't know. I kind of like it being able to mix and match. Um, and also kind of like that they weren't, you know, just give it to you all at once. Cause we have to, you know, uh, learn to, get used to it, harness both powers and find that balance so i mean doing this like slow release where you just kind of unlock the things through doing the story um yeah there are so many already did i read that and i just did i respond to that <laughs> what was that response to um but uh yeah i don't know kind of like it i like the the mix and match and being able to kind of like build it though i am concerned about the like super options here there's wrath so that's the one i currently have equipped can't equip that one yet and i've got nova bomb i got rid of that oh the war bonds okay yep 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 so yeah i <laughs> I already responded to that, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. I think it's cool. It is like, I don't know, a little bit jarring when they do like the vibrant colors and stuff like that here in destiny, because it does kind of just, uh, showcase that this is an older game and, you know, if they were going to stick with it for the long haul, they probably would up 
like you know remastered a little bit with their patches and stuff like that but for what it is it's still a pretty game um seven year old game built on top of a 10 year old game so uh yeah definitely definitely not definitely looks that age but uh i mean yeah so far dlc wise for th first three campaign missions done now i'd say feels like destiny it's definitely better than their last dlc um probably the best one since forsaken but so far not quite as good as forsaken um but I, that i mean that can also change pretty quickly <laughs> a lot of the things that i disliked about some of uh those dlcs happened towards the end of the dlc so we'll see Hopefully they're able to flesh things out a little bit more. And I kind of feel like they are going to just because like when I went to the tower, I got a freaking pop up message that said, no, 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 don't do anything else. Go complete the campaign first. And they've never done that shit before, um, uh, which is kind of kind of interesting. I'm really interested to see how that plays out. And I think it might be to do with the seasons might actually have more interesting things to say this time fingers crossed i mean i mean i didn't i didn't pay for the season passes because why would i but uh, usually the seasonal events and stuff like you know, get anyway but who knows yeah we'll have to we'll have to wait and see because i know that they were going to restructure those somehow but will be interesting to see how that works out and these are not the things that i will plan on talking about today or in this little thing but like i said wasn't planning to stream so i left my notes in the other room but halo halo is the big one that if that rumor ends up being true that's pretty cool probably will not buy it myself because i already have the master chief collection on both xbox one and pc so like why would i get it on ps5 but if it's a like remaster or like remake maybe and if it's like you know i if it, it might, it's probably going to be a whole new dev team too because they like laid off pretty much all 343 so i guess it would be interesting to see what this new team if i'm remembering correctly or they laid off a large portion of them. It'd be interesting to see like how that team like you know manages it if the rumors are true. So um, yeah, which I feel like it might be because it was like uh, a I think it was a Bloomberg article, Bloomberg article based off and like or no not a Bloomberg article but someone that works at Bloomberg released it and it was based off of a newsletter that they got so yeah i guess we'll see maybe it'll be announced on on sunday if not sunday then wednesday for at sgf i think that's the acronym for it um but anyway i think that is going to be all for tonight um keep an eye on my schedule for uh any updates there on if i can work in my final fantasy 7 rebirth stream um otherwise i might just do like random streams when i'm like i'm gonna play destiny i'm gonna play it tonight and then just you know stream it because why not um and that'll probably all come down to who's online by the time i get on my computer so <laughs> um but yeah otherwise hope you'll have a great night or whenever you're watching this if you're watching this on youtube or in the twitch vod hope you enjoyed the stream or enjoyed the video and we will see you next time <laughs>